Now that we have the handles of our toe bag made, it's time to make the bottom portion. To do that, you need to take your sleeves. For us, we have these little tiny short sleeves here, which is fine. No matter what size sleeve you have, you'll be able to make your closure. What you wanna do is cut a strip out of the sleeve that we're gonna to use to tie off the bottom of the bag. And what I like to do is to cut off the sleeve hem. You'll see right here the hem of the sleeve, and I want to cut just to the side of it so that I keep that stitching in with the hem. We'll cut all the way around. Now, if you're working with a t-shirt that for some reason doesn't have a hem, you can make the same tie out of the body of the sleeve, that's fine. This is what it looks like now that it's cut off, but if you wanna go ahead and make your tie out of this portion, that's fine too. I like to use the hem because it's a little bit stronger. The fabric is less likely to rip because we have that stitching on the hemline. It makes it a little bit sturdier and then what you're gonna do is just cut it open, like so. So we have a string. And then we're gonna thread this string through the bottom of our t-shirt. You'll notice at the bottom of your t-shirt you'll have a hem, and basically it's just the end of the fabric folded over and sewn. So all you're gonna do is take some scissors and slice a little hole right into the bottom of your hem. Now you'll notice we have a little tiny opening that we've created that allows us to put our tie through this casing. So you can go ahead and take your shirt and lay it down, go back to the tie that we've made, and this is where the safety pin comes in. So you'll take your safety pin at the end of your tie and just thread it through, close the safety pin up, and you're gonna use the safety pin to help feed this tie all the way through your shirt. So to do that, you'll start at one end of your opening and you're just going to put the safety pin in and work your way through the casing that you've made, pulling your tie through. Now, as you're doing this, because our tie is not as long as the t-shirt casing, you need to be careful about losing the end in the casing. If that happens, you'll have to start over. So, just be mindful of that as you go along. Now you can see it's kind of bunching up here, which is good. We don't want it to fall off the end of our tie. So you can just kind of pull it through and keep going. All right, we've come to our second side seam. So it's helpful if you just kind of push down from the bottom of the hem, kind of open the casing up a little bit, and that helps the safety pin go through much quicker. And here's our safety pin. So, we wanna pull the tie through, so now we have the two sides of our ties are through our casing, and now we're ready to finish the tote. 